I'm Matt Thurber, Editor-in-Chief of Aviation International News. And I was lucky enough to get invited to Dassault Aviation's Istra France flight test facility. And the reason I came here was the opportunity for the last flight of a Falcon 7X equipped with a unique new piece of equipment. What Dassault has done is taken a concept that was developed for the Rafale fighter, a single throttle controlling both engines, and updated and adapted it to the fly-by-wire flight control system on the Falcon 7X. I joined Dassault Aviation in 2005. By that time, the Rafale was still already flying with just one single throttle for two engines. And usually when we make something simple, it works well. So we said one axis, one command. When you lose an engine, you will fly it exactly the same way as you do when you have three engines. With this kind of device, everything is happening on the same axis. So you don't have to move your hands. There is no mistakes made in the cockpit. So we decided to extend the concept and that's a good point in between military aircraft and civilian aircraft we have got kind of a synergy. The smart throttle is like an enhanced auto throttle but taking advantage of digital technology to add safety features such as more comprehensive emergency descent modes, engine failure mitigation and most importantly upset recovery. Recovery mode is when you are lost, you just press on the button and it will bring you back to a nice straight and level. It will bring you back to 250 knots and it will bring you back wings level, whatever the starting position. Pull to seven degrees, roll all the way to 120 degrees, one. Two, three. Wow. I flew a variety of maneuvers to put the aircraft in an upset condition. And each time we pressed the recovery button, the digital flight control system smoothly and precisely returned the 7X to straight and level flight, pulling at most 1.7G, well below the maximum of 2.5G. Business aviation going nearly inverted is not very common. We went to uh, a bit more than 120 degrees of roll and you see it's very neat the way it goes out. Uh, the roll first and then the pullback and give it back to you. The digital flight control system operates much faster than a human can, using any control needed to care for the airplane and its occupants. Ultimately, the recovery process was safe and amazingly smooth. It was a lot of fun getting to flip the 7X nearly all the way over. Watching the gorgeous Marseille coastline fill the windows and feeling forces rarely felt in a business jet. Recovery is also the first step to AGCAS, Air Ground Collision Avoidance System, which will automatically allow the aircraft to avoid the ground. The trajectory is computed all the time, and when you see that it's going to be with a potential impact on the ground, then the aircraft will automatically take back controls and do kind of a recovery maneuver to put yourself back onto a nice pass and save everybody on board. The flight testing that Dassault conducted on the experimental 7X revealed significant safety and operational benefits. However, the company hasn't yet decided on whether the smart throttle and recovery mode features might be integrated into its forthcoming Falcon Next model. I think the pilots are really gonna love it once they try it. It's very simple and intuitive. It really makes flying the airplane, I think, a lot safer and easier.